Good day, everybody! This is BA Ready and Dawn, again! And, uh, this time we have a banner trailer! So this is gonna be the new Heroes banner that's coming in on the... I think it's like the 8th, I think, is when this banner is supposed to drop. And it's gonna be a new Heroes banner, so because it's a midpoint, it's gonna be a Mythic and three other... three other units that are not in the game yet. Uh, it's gonna be Sparkable, so we'll get the Celestial Stone if you pull on it. And, um, I saw who's in the thumbnail. It's, uh, not and more. So, let's not wait to get into this. No, sorry. Sorry, don't dislike. Don't dislike. I know that was a bad joke. Don't dislike. Sometimes I'm funny, but sometimes I'm not. Anyway, let's get into this. Fire Emblem Heroes! New heroes, join the battle! Shadows of Valentia. Pala, okay. The Lady Blade, okay. So, you inflict speed minus five, unit attacks twice, calculates da- oh, and it's got effective damage. Okay, and she's and she's got built-in canto. She can canto two spaces. Okay, okay. So, okay, so, she can double, she has speed minus five, but she's got canto. And she's got lower defensive res thing, which is cool. There's red dual flying four, which is pretty neat. And attack res rain. So we already know what the dual flyings do. I have green dual flying on my Micaiah because Brave Micaiah is a boss. Come at me. So that's pretty cool. This is a pretty good... So, and... Hmm. What's the premier unit going to be, I wonder? It's Zeke! Okay! Ooh, I see Defense Res Menace. Ooh. So he's got the Holy Gradivus! Counter attack, regardless of foe's range, just start a combat if unit HP is greater than 25%. Unit makes a guaranteed follow up attack. He's got Bonfire, attack defense catch 4, little attack defense 3, and Defense Res Menace. Holy crap! So he's gonna be gaining what? He's going to get a guaranteed follow-up attack. He's going to be getting attack defense plus, like, 9. Basically, attack plus 12. Basically, attack plus 18, essentially. Holy crap, that's terrifying. And yeah, he's a lance cav. Okay. Not a problem. Luthier! Okay, so this this banner is actually really cool because um, I'm going to toss the link in the description below. But check out my top 10 units not yet in Fae Shadows of Valentia edition, okay? That has a lot of these units on it. So let's go. Luthier is a green tome. And he's a demo. <laughs> Uh, he's got some Sparrow too, and Guard. That's good four-star fodder. He's trash otherwise, though. There's not... Let's not make any more jokes. Okay, so she's a defense dark mythic. Speed Menace? Oh shit! Okay! I want Attack Speed Menace! So Attack Speed Menace would probably do really well on Fallen Ike. So you could bump up his speed. And Attack Speed Menace bumps his attack even further. Uh, I want a Speed Defense Menace, honestly, but either way. So, a sort of combat if Unity HP is greater than 25%, grants Spectrum 5 and bonus. Equals current bonus on each of unit's stats for one turn during con- Ooh, okay. So if unit has plus 7 bonus to attack, grants attack plus 12. Hang on, what? So, and and she has Pathfinder. So, gr at start of con- Grants attack, speed, defense, res, plus 5. 
and bonus to attack speed defense res during combat equals current bonus on each of unit's stats for one turn. If unit has plus seven bonus attack to attack, grants plus att attack plus 12 for a net bonus of attack plus 19. Okay. Dragon Fang, Distant Counter, Moon Twin Wing. If unit HP is greater than 25%, inflicts attack speed minus 5 on foe during combat. And if unit speed is greater than foe speed, she has damage reduction. Nice. And attack speed menace. Great skill. If unit is within 4 spaces of a foe, attack speed minus 6 on closest foes. Grants attack speed plus 6 to unit for one turn. I want attack speed menace because that's a really good skill. So yeah. So, one thing I find interesting is this banner is kind of stacked for blue. I, there's no reason to pull colorless or really green. It's all red and blue, if I remember correctly. There's no reason to pull colorless at all. It's a kind of a bad banner for that. And there's still more of it. Oh, it's because it's sparkable. Yep, there's a spark. Oh, we already know about... You don't need to put this in every video. We already know. This is just a waste of my time. Okay, so... Uh, yeah, red and blue are the best to pull on green if you like Luthier and you want to build him, sure, otherwise don't bother pulling on green and colorless doesn't exist. So it's just red and blue. Strictly red and blue. So have fun. If you enjoyed this video, like, comment, subscribe. Are you going to be pulling on this banner? If so, why? Uh, let me know down in the comment below, comment section below. And yeah, if you like this video, like, comment, subscribe. And until next time, this is Be Ready Dawn signing off. Bye.